Tonight, we're once again celebrating Western New York as the students in Parkland, Florida continue to recover from last month's mass shooting at the school. A cheerleader from SUNY Fredonia has set up a letter writing campaign. Her goal? To have community members express their personal messages of support and hope for those students. Here in their own words, Alexandra Zwerka Gentle and her coach and athletic director. Hi, my name is Allie and I'm from New York. I'm a cheerleader at Fredonia University and I study psychology. I'm writing you this letter to make your days a little easier. I came from a really community-based high school, so I'm used to reaching out to people and helping, and I like to help in any way I can. I know if I was in that situation, I can't imagine, but I would want to read something from someone to know they care. I hope it prompts other student athletes and other students here and even, I mean, on Facebook, people just see it and are obligated to reach out and help. It's, it takes a, maybe 10 minutes out of my day to write that letter, but I know it made the student's whole day. I really had such a little part in it and it was really student driven, uh, which is nice to see that they are so inspired by these other heroes that we had down in that school that day. We all can like and share and retweet on you know, social media, but when that student opens that letter and reads it and it's personal, it means a lot more. We work long and hard to try to create global citizens and people that want to leave campus and impact the world, and I've got a sophomore that's doing it. I know everything is stressful right now, but things will get easier. You are so strong and I admire you. Even though you might be younger than me, you are still my hero. I hope reading this letter puts a smile on your face and helps you see the brighter side of today. Thank you for being you. And so far, at least 10 such letters have been written at SUNY Fredonia, and they're encouraging others to get involved. We'll have more information on our website at WGRZ.com.